The Ohio women's basketball team wrapped up a three-game homestand on Sunday afternoon against Eastern Kentucky. I'm WLUV sports reporter Brian Kirp here at the Convocation Center. The Bobcats are looking to start the season with a 3-0 record. The Bobcats ran on the court to face Eastern Kentucky, and they also ran away with this one early on. In the first quarter, it was the CC Hook Show. Right here, Gabby Burris misses a three, Hooks gets the rebound, battles in the paint, gets fouled, and puts it in for two. And then she takes care of things herself with a nice, simple layup. Well, I was just locked in and focused, and I knew that we needed the energy to keep us focused throughout the whole game, so I just came ready to play. Hook scored the Bobcats' first nine points of the game and had a team-high 21 points. The Bobcats cruised to a 52-28 halftime lead. Hooks, Amani Burke, and Erica Johnson were all in double figures at the half. The Bobcats continued to cruise in the second half behind Kaylee Bambiel. Off the bench, Bambiel was on fire from beyond the arc. She had 12 points in the game, all off of three-pointers. She loved it, and her teammates on the bench also loved it. The entire team was 10 for 18 from beyond the arc. With 15 seconds left in the game, Kendall Jessing puts the Cats at the century mark. They went on to win 100 to 60 over Eastern Kentucky. The Bobcats had five players in double figures and continued to rack up the point totals early in the season. I didn't think that we would be quite this efficient. I mean, I'm obviously thrilled that we are and understand that it's just a, it's a very small sample size, right? I mean, it's three games of basketball, three and three games at home. Next up, the Bobcats will travel to participate in the Denver Thanksgiving Classic and will face St. Bonaventure on Friday. From inside the Convocation Center, I'm WAB sports reporter Brian Kerp.